Uh, so I discovered the college maybe nine or ten years ago um, when we'd had our first little child. So Zach was born and we were looking at schools. Um, I've been a teacher for more than 20 years. Always thought that I would send my children to a public school. I was very heavily um, pro public education, had worked in the public sector for 15 years or so. When I had my boy and he was uh, growing up, I realised I wanted a school that I felt I could be in partnership with. And I wanted the school to align with our values and our morals. And I wanted to be able to feel like I had a say in his education and not just to deal with the academic growth of the child, but also the social, emotional and spiritual wellbeing for my boy. made the decision for Zach to do prep and he was there two days a week and throughout that year there were times which I call my light bulb moments. So I made a decision for 12 months for prep, wasn't too sure what the rest of the journey would look like but throughout the year walking through the quad hearing kids involved in praise and worship at the beginning of the, the, the day, hearing the amazing Geraldine Painter and her interaction with the kids with such joy, I knew that this was a different place to bring up children. So I was uh, very happy to continue the journey for my boy. So he was here for three years and a job came up and so I applied for the position um, and now we're talking about eight years here on staff so a bit of a journey along the way um, but God had his hand on every part of that journey along the way. If you asked me 10 years ago would this be my reality I would have laughed and said no <laughs> but God knew that this was the journey for me and this was the journey for the college as well and feel honoured that he's brought all of those things together so that this is not only the place for my children but it's also the place for myself. So the journey here when I first started, my first year here I was head of infants and supervised three classes. <laughs> we had one kindy, one year one and one year two and loved that journey and uh, implementing change there. And towards the end of the year, made, the school made the decision to hire uh, advertise for a head of primary role that would be non-teaching. So threw my hat in the ring and here we are after a process um, and loved the journey in taking on that new role and knowing, not knowing what that journey would look like for me, uh, but being honoured to be part of that journey with the school. So when I started here, we had seven classes across primary. Today we have 19 classes in seven years and that's amazing growth along the way. So it's been um, a definite intensive growth journey as we've grown from seven classes to 19 classes. But it's been beautiful to be able to maintain that sense of community, to maintain that understanding of the individual at the, at the heart and not lose that as we grow in size for the college. So it's, it's fairly amazing when you think that we've come 40 years and you know for me haven't been all, in, all of those 40 years but an amazing opportunity to be part of the last eight years on staff um, and to see the change in the college from growth of students, from academic understanding, from developing a learning framework, uh, that's an amazing opportunity for us and I love that I'm part of that journey as we uh, grow the college. Um, that I can't imagine what the next season will be for us as a college. It definitely feels like we're on the cusp of something new as we continue to grow and continue to deeply embed that learning framework for our students. So knowing that the college started off with a small group of students, with one or two teachers, um, wanting to make a difference in the lives of their children, to growing that community to where we are today, known as a community that is one that uh, deeply understands and desires for our students to be academic learners, that deeply desires for our students to have an understanding of their creator and what that means for them in their lives, but also has an understanding of themselves that when they leave, that they are to be people of worth that they are to be people of um, purpose, that they're here for a reason. And 
For me, in my role, I think that's an amazing privilege that I have to be able to come alongside to each of the individuals. And for us as a college to know that for 40 years, we've created a place that's developed who we are and what we are now, and that that history and heritage is deeply embedded in who we are. And I feel honoured to be able to walk the journey ahead in whatever the next season looks like, uh, being able to continue to create all that God envisaged for here and for me to be part of the puzzle that puts that story together um, is an honour and not one that I don't think any of us here at the college takes lightly. It's a great place to be.